Hello, welcome to CSE Sports. I'm your host, Jay Howard, and I have a question for all of you guys out there that watched the game last night. The Brooklyn Nets versus the Chicago Bulls. The Bulls came out victorious 90-82, to but what was startling in that game is that Kirk Howard played pretty good. I'm not a huge Kirk Heinrich fan anymore. I used to love Kirk, but I don't like him anymore like I used to, but I must give Kirk credit when credit is due. I must honor Kirk Heinrich today. And the question I have to ask you guys, did Kirk Heinrich shut down the run Williams? In my opinion, he did a damn good job on him, and I think he shut him down. That's right. Honor that man. Honor Kirk. Get, get Kirk. It's, it's just due. Let's look at the statistics. Kurt Heinrich, 13 points, 5 assists, 3 rebounds, 2 steals. Deron Williams, 8 points, 10 assists. Four rebounds and one steal. Now, you might say, hey, Jay, he still dropped 10 dimes. How? But look, Kirk forced that man to pass more than try to score. Real talk. And, and, and in my opinion, that is shutting the player down. When I say shut him down, I think I'm going overboard a little bit. I would say Kirk defended him well and made him alter his game. Kirk did do that. You know what I mean? He did do that. I don't care how you put it. He made Deron Williams alter his game last night and he did a damn good job i don't know if it's going to continue there's going to be a lot of people out to say jay you're the same one talking about nate robinson this nate Rob I, i'm still talking nate 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 you saw those three pointers last night well <laughs> getting back to kirk henry giving him his praise i thought I, th I thought that kirk came uh with a little bit more passion to to contribute something because kirk is like I don't know. He never got better. I mean, it was a, it was a stage in his career when he first came to the Bulls. He actually was the first player out of that new Bulls movement that really got the Bulls into the playoffs. When they played against Washington that one year, Kirk like put it on his back. The Bulls were down and out. Sorry, Kirk said, "Come on, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna live up to my contract. I mean, my rookie contract that is, and I'm gonna come out here and do my thing." But it seemed like when he got traded and Derrick Rose came in, he just never. It's like he gave up on basketball. I hope to end this video. I hope that Kirk can do this at least three more times. You know what I mean? I hope that he can, you know, put his foot in the run and just help the Bulls steal this series. Because you know, they're not the favorites in the series anymore. You know, you gotta um, go back to Chicago, and I think the Bulls are gonna play well at home. But a lot of people were thinking after that first game that it was over with for the Bulls. But the Bulls bounced back. Let's give them some credit for that. And I want to end with saying to you guys, um, Derrick Rose, I don't think that he's going to come back. I haven't heard anything about it. But he was there to support the Bulls, and I'm happy that he was there to support the Chicago Bulls. So I'm going to give him some credit for being there on the bench and trying to do much as he can. Even though he's not doing anything physically for him, he was there, you know, on the bench cheering him on. I respect him for that. But I want to know, do you think Kurt Heinrich shut down De'Ron Williams? Peace from CSE Sports.